Hi, my name is Afri Grace Rivera, and I'm the mother and founder of The Wata Wellness. The Wata Wellness is a space that is open to receive anybody, everybody's different walks of life, any gender, age, from even dogs, <laughs> to kids, to seniors, to do yoga, different types of wellness and fitness. So we do meditation, we do different styles of yoga, we have hit boxing, so really different types of modalities to get yourself fit and also not just the outside but also the inside. How the Wata started? The Wata started from a dream and from that dream it became a reality. So actually the word the Wata is a Cebuana word which means to receive or to accept and it came from my Lola who passed away already but um, I had a dream with her. She keeps saying to my dream, the Wata, the Wata, the Wata and I was like, what? Like, and then when I woke up, it, like the word itself has been with me the whole day and I mentioned this to my partner and my partner was like, oh my god, that's a beautiful word. And then I told them about the meaning, which is to accept and to receive. And from that time, everything come together. Everything just uh, pieced out together from the people that we talk about it to all the things that we've been doing around wellness. Every day is always a challenge. It's di different situations, different challenges that we all come along that I counter. But I think that this phrase that uh, has been with me ever since is to keep going. So with all your challenges in life, with all the struggles, even with the success, just keep going with it and trust that uh, you will be guided. And um, also to have that strength and support is very important. And yoga has been there to help me out with being a mom and being a businesswoman. It allows me to see different perspectives in life. When I started doing yoga, I learned how to understand more. I learned how to bring more patience into my life. And it also allows me to see the other side of the situation. So not just my perspective, but to others' perspective. So yoga is like my connection to my work-life balance. If you're intimidated, I was intimidated before. It took me three years to actually practice yoga because Yes, I was intimidated and I feel like, oh, yoga is for flexible people. Yoga is for rich people. If you just have the courage and the strength to show up for yourself, that's when everything just fall in line. And giving yourself a permission to give yourself time. It takes a lot of guts, it takes a lot of excuses to show up for yourself. But I think when it's time, it's really time. When you have that opportunity that yoga is there, even just a friend will tell you, hey, let's do yoga, always say yes. Uh, I think this is very timely about the future of the Wata. We are actually doing a lot of events here. Actually tonight we're doing acoustic night and then we usually do trivia nights here or karaoke nights. Every month we do retreats, yoga retreats, not just in Cebu, but we go outside Cebu. And we partnered with different companies where we do yoga to their space or to their team. And what is coming is the Wata Fiesta. The Wata Fiesta has been collaborating with our students here and teachers. It's been cooked. And now we're ready to serve the Wata Fiesta soon on April 16 at circa 1900. And this is a celebration of bringing people together, the community together through yoga, music, arts, and um, culture. A lot is happening. And yeah, and I'm going to end it with uh, here in Dawate, we're always open to receive different things, different people, and everyone. If you'd like to receive good vibes and if you want to share your good energy, please follow us on Instagram and like us on Facebook. It's at thewata.wellness. Our website is www.thewatawellness.com and we are located in uh, Zenith Central Ayala Avenue. It's right in front of Ayala Center Cebu. And yes, we are open to receive you every day here. Hi, I'm Safri Grace Rivera and catch the Wata Wellness on Kita.